104 Eastern Time. As we come to you from Studio J in Atlanta. Fun night of play in action right there. Fun night. Come on, man. You were entertained that was by those two games? That, that were was you, not. Were you, were you entertained? <laughs> yes. Oh, come on, Chuckster. That was awful come on, basketball. Come on, West Coast time, honey. It's only 10 o'clock. That's come right. On. That's come on. Right. That was awful basketball. It's inside the NBA, by the way. It's presented by <laughs> Kia and Junk. Let's jump right into the highlights of this one. It Maybe it's better the second time around. Let's not, let's not waste another second. That's it. Jaden McDaniels on the bench. Broke his hand, punching a wall. Gobert, punching a teammate, suspended, wouldn't be there. They, they, did, they still on, almost won. Take on the Lakers, LeBron. Carl Anthony Towns. This is what I thought he should have did more of, honey. Well, he was shooting that step back over Austin Reeves. You know, that's good basketball when you're 7-2. Sure is, especially after you start 5-5. Five for five. Rui Hachimura blocked that's by a heck Anthony of a block. Edwards. Come on, man. You guys are lovers. Well, Minnesota will fight. We know that for sure. <laughs> LeBron for three knocks it down. Part of a 14 to two run for the Lakers to get back in the game. Ooh, English. Tell you what, LeBron is amazing. It's hard for a guy 40 years old to be killing himself in a play-in game. Minnesota comes back with a 14-2 run of their own. Mike Conley had a great game, knocks down the three. He did. 60-49, to 49, Minnesota at the half. One more. Oh, good finish. This was a heck of a play here. You know, his ability to get to the rim and shoot floaters like he's, you know, like a guard. But I thought he, I thought he should have took advantage of his size already. <laughs> A lot more. Slow mo hit the three. They were up 80 to 65. Yeah, but. But know, in the fourth quarter, there was nothing offensively from Minnesota. Well, because they were, I don't know what they were doing. I'm not going to lie. I mean, they were just giving the ball to. And Anthony should have put his head down and went to the basket. And the Carl, I don't know what Carl was doing. Davis had 24 and 15, oh, good pass. by the way. Uh, Mike Conley, man, I, I love watching that kid play, man. That three was their last bucket of regulation. Oh, good block. Better finish. 95-92, and then LeBron. We got ourselves a tie game at 95. Yeah, Minnesota kept giving them chances, and Lakers do what they always do, fight back. Under 10 seconds to go. Give it to the guy who has ice water in his veins. Oh, oh I thought that was DeAngelo Russell's name. <laughs> He's still in, he's still in moves. Still don't some celebrate too still. early, though, Ernie. Oh, look at them, look at them, look at them. Yeah, don't celebrate too early. Because with 1.4 to play, oh. inbound to Mike Conley, fouled by Anthony Davis shooting the three. Man, I want him to make this three, because this is just dumb. <laughs> Conley, first one. Yeah. Ah, get in there. <laughs> Second one. Piece of cake. Mm, without holding his follow. -up. First one was the one, Ernie. Oh, I know. And then the third I think one. All three were all. Yeah, one, yeah one. you gotta, you gotta hit all three, and he did. And we are going Kenny two overtime. <laughs> <laughs> and in overtime. Inside joke, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Mm, good pass. Nice give and go to Schroeder with the lay. Now, that was a heck of a pass right there, knowing that Anthony Davis can go get that on the other side of the run. That was a hell of a catch with a hell of a move also. Five-point lead for the Lakers at that point. Anthony Edwards had a miserable night. Does cut it to three. And the Lakers... Man, what the hell? Man, a couple of terrible inbound oh, this, plays late in the game. Ooh, man. Orion Prince couldn't connect. And LeBron and the Lakers are out of the play-in and into the playoffs as they head to Memphis to take on the Grizzlies after their 108 to 102 win. The Timberwolves, this is the 19th time this season that they had a double-digit lead and lost the game. That ties them with the Blazers for the most 
in the NBA. Technically, I guess it doesn't because these numbers don't count in regular <laughs> season or in playoffs, but you get my drift. 108. This didn't happen, America. 102 is the final. <laughs> if you do a post-game show during the play-in, does it exist? No. I have no idea. Are we in a vacuum Wait. right now? I have no, no idea. Seriously, it is 109 in the morning. Yeah. Why are we still here? Because we're watching the play-in Well, today. if the game didn't happen, why are we <laughs> Did we just make up those Did highlights? Like... Did they not actually happen? Oh. Wow. So what'd you make of this as the Lakers came back? Yeah, they fought hard, but it's more about the dismantalization of Minnesota. Uh, you know, what? The, the what of it? What of it? Huh? Dismantalization. I don't know if it's a word. <laughs> it probably isn't. <laughs> oh, I got dismantalization. it. Dismantalization. That's a six syllable. That's not a word. word. Not a word. You cannot use six syllables. Dismantle, dismantle is a word. word. First of all, it's a word because word. I said it. Okay. okay. How about that? But, Disintegration. You know, Call Anthony Town needed to play a little bit more aggressive. I, 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 he didn't score, what, six, seven minutes? Uh, Anthony Edwards, I'm and not going to jump on him. picked up that fifth foul, too, yeah. Yeah, uh, Anthony Edwards, not going to jump on him, but, you know, he needs to learn that in, in situations like this, you need to play better. The Three for play, 17. Yeah, that's, nice. that's not going to cut it. However, they still had opportunities to win the game. They got very stagnant at the end. It's like, no, you shoot, you shoot, you shoot, you shoot. Nobody wanted the ball. Nobody was definitive with their moves. And then the Lakers... We were used to playing from behind, came back, played, stuck with it, stuck with it, caught fire, got the crowd involved in the game, and they were able to win the game. But I would have, have liked to have seen them, like I've been saying all, all night, like to have seen them come out, send a message to these teams, like, hey, we're going to crush you guys by 30. You guys are you know, under man. We're going to crush you by 30. But that was a tough game. And they could have lost that game, but sure. they won. So. Now they have to face the mighty Memphis Grizzlies in, and, and, in the first round. And Minnesota goes home, where on Friday night they will take on the winner of the New Orleans-Oklahoma City game, and the winner will be the number eight seed and get the Denver Nuggets. Meantime, the Lakers get the Memphis Grizzlies. Yeah, uh, the, the best people and the happiest people in the world right now has got to be the uh, Memphis Grizzlies. You know, because you saying to yourself, like, man, the Lakers are playing great. They've had the second-best record. And they come out flat like that. You know, they had the, uh, the Wolves had 11 turnovers and five baskets between the last quarter and, and overtime. And you're yeah. like. 16 points and 11 yeah. turnovers. That's crazy. Fourth quarter. I mean, uh, whatever that word Shaq made up, it's true. It's manalization. Yeah. I mean, Minnesota, and Reggie said, they're going to be kicking themselves. I I'm trying to figure out, just, just, just go back. You said that Memphis is happy? Yeah, because like, cause now you're like, okay, because you, you said to yourself, okay, they got LeBron James and Anthony Davis. And they're they happy about that? You know, yeah, but I'm saying, well, they're going to have probably the two best players on the court. But you see, this is the inconsistency we've been getting from the Lakers all year. Mm -hmm. This is why they're in the play-in. And Memphis wants to play off, refine your focus a little bit, and your fire. You, no, there's this notion that you can – what we saw right here was a perfect example of the Lakers today because this notion – and I feel the same way about the Golden State Warriors. This notion that you can turn it on, you can't turn okay. – you can't turn things Because on. I thought earlier we were talking about how this was a great path for the Lakers. It was. To play. And but this one but game has one turned game you your mind. Well, because this, this – yeah. they didn't deserve to win this game tonight. This, was, I, yeah. like, this is all about the Wolves choking this game away. Okay. Well, I, I think overall – um, when you talk about the Lakers first, and I'll get to Memphis, I think the, the Lakers, what they do have, you, you do see, is they have the ability to make plays, which makes them dangerous. Because there were two or three plays that Anthony Davis, the lob over the sides with, with uh, LeBron through to Anthony Davis, those are, those, are, those are not average catches and average finishes. Those are, those are guys Shaq makes, Charles would have made, Anthony Davis would make. Those are great plays that only great players can make in moments. So that's why they're dangerous. Same with Golden State. There are three-point shots that Steph Curry and Klay Thompson there can make that no one else in the world possibly can make. That's what makes them dangerous with experience. So, but Minnesota showed the lack of experience to me, just that basically their offense, you know, and, and, it's, and Carl Anthony Towns is too good a player to allow this to happen because the Lakers were switching everything. And they said, okay, we'll allow you to switch. So they said, okay, let's get Austin Reeves on Carl Anthony Towns. So freeze it here. 
When Austin Reeves on Seal. Carl Anthony Town, you, what, what you going to do, Shaq? Seal, Seal in the lane. On, it's well, a mouse in the house. Yeah, but, Everything uh, that we scream no that problem. happens, but we right don't. It, it's think, not, he goes see, away not, from not the see, basket. Not, I don't understand this right That's here. That's what I'm saying. That's why yeah, I blow the play. he got to come to this box. That's why I blow the play, because it doesn't make sense to me. Look well, at the score. It's 129-105. It's Again, we get we get the switch that we want. They're switching everything. Freeze it here. Now he got his shoulder. Are you kidding me? Schroeder on him he now. Did, this is this is when not only Carl Anthony Towns, but as your point guards and everyone else on the screaming, get the ball a cat. But, and but, he has to want it, and but, he has to get it. But the ball is, stays on the weak side of the floor. He doesn't fight for that position. He never gets over there. You let Schroeder and hold it. And then now you get a get here. Uh, shot clock went off, so the offensive rebound does not count. But so that's the point I'm. That is inexperienced this, this, in playoff that's moments. That's but, but that's that the point I'm trying to make. This is. This the, the, the Lakers didn't win this game. The Wolves lost this game. Don't, I mean, and Kenny, don't blame that on inexperience. That right there, looking at it, shows me that a guy doesn't want it. I, yeah, I agree with you, Shaq. That's when like, I yo, look at that. I, Reeves on me. I don't care what play you call it. I'm looking back. You got Reeves on me. Hey, man, swing it, throw him in. You, you, and and shoulder, too. He's too yeah. good a player that, not to that, let that. That's to what I'm saying. So. But because after, after, the third, after the third quarter. Two shots for Cat, well, no points. But also, though, you, right, 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 right. you go back and look, we sitting in there, when he's got Reeves on him at, like, the free throw line, he shot step-back jumpers. And we're like, what the hell are you doing? Reeves can't guard you. And I know what they're going to say. Oh, this is an old-school basketball. It's not about old-school basketball. In this era of basketball, it's all about matchups. If I got a little guy on me, I'm not shooting no step-back jumper, Ernie. I'm going to say, hey, forget that play. He's talking about Kenny. Bring me the ball. Yeah, because Boom. you're 100% right, Shaq, because everyone talks about the analytics. You know, you know, if you shoot, you know, four out of ten threes, you got to shoot six out of ten from, from, uh, from twos. That's an eight, 80% shot, too. So he's going to shoot. If Reeves is on him or Schroeder's on him, he's going to shoot 80%. 80%. So he's not going to shoot 60%. He's going to shoot 80% with those guys. In the words of the great Mike Wilbon, that Minnesota team dumb. I've never heard him say that. But 108. You need to watch PTI. I watch that every day. The Lakers that Wolf winners team is in Fiorello. overtime over the Minnesota Timberwolves. And so the Lakers Fiorello. will go to Memphis. It's there. Fiorello show. That's not how you would spell it anyway. I found it. <laughs> That's not a word, Chad. Dismantle is a word. I found it. Ernie, what's that say? Talking about basketball. Dismantleization. Dismantleization. It, Thank you. You certainly did see it there. Thank you. Well, I'm just going to go Shaq back to pay Google. I'm just going to go back to Dom. <laughs> Shaq got enough money to pay Google to do that. <laughs> Five minutes. When we come back, Celtics waiting for the winner. Hawks and Heat uh -huh. Uh -huh. playing in Miami. That's right, Ernie. A-A-W, A-A-W. Uh -huh.